Hi, Thomas. Uh, the Champions League is the one big competition that Manchester City have not won. They've suffered a lot of painful defeats, including yeah. to you at Chelsea. Um, does that make them more dangerous, or does it offer you some hope that you know they could perhaps suffer some more pain? I'm not so concerned about the general, uh, the general circumstances uh, of the match and especially for our opponent for Manchester City. I'm well aware of it. To be very honest, I felt, I felt this kind of uh, possibility that the momentum can shift to our side during the first match in, uh, in, in, in pretty long parts of the match. But I was, uh, we uh, together uh, were proven wrong. I was proven wrong. We were like, we were punished brutally from from them. And uh, the thing is that they are in top shape. They are in top shape. They are in full confidence. They um, arrive here in, in 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 April and May in the decisive months of the season. And it seems like they have that difficult spell that every team has maybe in a season already behind them that makes them very dangerous and, um, and, and very tough to beat. It's the benchmark at the moment, I would say, in, in Europe, and we're up for it. But it's, it's one match, you know, now it's, now it's down to one match, uh, and in one match anything can happen. So we're going for the, for the win tomorrow. And uh, like I say, uh, in a football match, there are moments when you have the support, when you have like the, the little decision, when you have the amount of luck that you need, 